You rest. A small cough today will be a chest infection tomorrow. And what sort of Eid will that be then? I feel sure. <laughs> right, I need to get to the restaurant. I'll walk you to the bus stop. OK, then. So you are, what, you're selling advertising space for political magazines? Yeah, I do. I work with Sam, and I work with this communications company. So. Okay, and we've got an accountant here. Yeah, that's me. And, and quizzing brings you together still? Yep. Can I ask how good you are? Um, very good. Look it, we had them! <laughs> wow. It's a new move so quick. Might want to try chasing your own man, might be easy to catch, eh? Meaning? You should never see him running away from money like that, do you? When does my love life become any of your business? I've got my own man, thanks. <laughs> Keep telling yourself that, darling. Sorry, remind me again how um, romantic it is living with your gay ex and his mum. Mm. Much better than being the other woman, actually. Well, I'm not. Right. Like you said, though, none of my business. You look, um, stunning. Do you think so? <laughs> Thanks. I was going to meet someone, but um, I might not bother now. He's a bit flaky. Oh, is that one of them um, wristers that your grandmother sets you up with? Oh, yeah, but this one, he's a total loser. <laughs> <laughs> so, you going home? Actually, I quite fancy a mocktail. Oh, I'm going, I'm going to the bar too, so, uh, Susan, same again? What are you playing at? What are you playing at? Working? I know. I shouldn't have lied. Who do you think you are? I'm not some sort of doll you can pick up and put down whenever it suits you. You started this, remember? And I wish I hadn't. You think you're all that, don't you? But you're not. You're nothing but a liar and a cheat. Don't say that. So are you leaving, honey? Because uh, we could tell her right now, if you like. Cross me, little girl. Don't give me a reason to, old man. <laughs> I am no one's bit on the side. I'm done. We are done. Don't even think of calling or sending a flirty text. Or I will make sure everyone knows exactly what sort of man you are. Have you been served yet? Uh, we were just talking about how bad mocktails were for the teeth. <laughs> yeah, you're right. And I'm putting an end to the sugar. He's all yours. <laughs> what? It was a bit early last night. What's wrong? Nothing. Abs. I ended it with Adam. <laughs> yeah, right. I did. Oh, you did? Like, for real? I can't do this. I can't sit there pretending that everything's normal. I still love him. Oh, my goodness. These are pudding spoons. Please hurry, girls. Bobby will be here soon. It's an important day for him. Well, I've got to go. I can't do all this on my own. What? It's Bobby. He sent a text saying he's changed his mind. So? Leave him. I can't do that. Look, I'll be back before Adam arrives. Promise. Don't worry. Be fine. It's age that teaches us that the heart doesn't always know what's good for us. No, but I am sorry. Truly. It's not your fault. It's not even Adam's fault. <laughs> it's mine. When Adam came to us, he was so young, so damaged. We had one job, to make him feel loved and safe. And we failed. <laughs> you, you actually sound sorry for him. <laughs> no, well, don't be. Adam knows exactly what he's doing. 
I understand why you're so angry. No, I, I don't need you to understand. I knew what I was doing too. The only victim in this is, is Honey. Well, for better or for worse, she seems to love him. So we have to hope that she never finds out. Um, she already knows. Oh, you died, it look like a dinosaur. Right, we're gonna have to do something about your costume because sexy pumpkin, nil point. Ah, I'll tell you what, Stuart's hot dog. You could be hot dog Habiba. You want to dress up a Muslim woman as a sausage. Yeah, good luck with that. All right, well, have you got any better ideas? Because otherwise I'm gonna have to let you go. But fire me. Yeah. Look, I need to claw back the lunchtime trade. I've got no other choice. No, I need this job. All right. Then we need to take Keegan out. Kill him? No, not kill him. We crush his business before he crushes us. Oh.